Welcome to Finland. Just flew into Helsinki and I have picked up my rental car for the weekend. I'm gonna go see some Twitch friends in uh, the city not too far from uh, Helsinki. But that means driving for a little bit and uh, I rented a Volvo or similar. And uh, we've ended up with this. Check it out. So, it's a Nissan Qashqai. Not really very similar. <laughs> She's like, yeah, it's similar, it's similar. I'm like, no. All right, never mind, we didn't get the Volvo. Uh, first time driving in Finland, first time being in Finland, and it's about to get dark. So that could be quite interesting. I'm sure I'll be able to find my way. Uh, we've got the GPS. Never driven one of these before. The, uh, the Nissans aren't too bad, I suppose. Could be worse cars. Let's hit the road and see how we do. Well, I apologise for the darkness. And again, car interior light, late in Finland. I'm driving about two hours, two and a half hours now. Done about 200 kilometres. Everything's in kilometres here. Over through Finland. Anyway, enough about the car. Uh, let's go meet Henna and her boyfriend Jay, who have very kindly agreed to let me stay with them after my long journey. Hello, I'm, I'm known as Helene on Twitch, and uh, I mostly stream flute playing, but also some games. We're going to uh, visit the Moomin Museum, and we're going to eat on a nice place, and then we're going to go escape Mars, which will be awesome, I hope, kind of. And uh, we are going to just uh, go play some board games on a local board game cafe. I stream when I'm trying to learn how to play guitar on Twitch. I try to learn using both a tool called Rocksmith and I try to use an acoustic, playing a little bit, learning the rhythm games of it. I've been doing Twitch as a streamer learning guitar for about two years. I started streaming on Twitch way before that when I was a hardcore raider in World of Warcraft. When it wasn't called Twitch, it was called JTV, and it had this awesome feature that meant that you could password protect your streams, so you could only invite a select few to watch your streams. That's when I started, and then the account kind of, kind of carried over. And when do I start? When it, whenever you're ready. Oh god. <laughs> do I have to, like... <laughs> I'm Nuno, or no 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 on Twitch, and I stream there, several games, and my learning journey. That's 12 news, it's even hard for me to say. From 2012, I've been there, stalking around, but I started streaming on Twitch around 2014. It's really hard for me to remember. <laughs> we went to the Moomoo Mo Mo Museum here with Helena Fay, Nunu, FW, and a bunch of other streamers and chatters, and it was pretty fun. I expected a little bit of an ex ex uh, exhibition, but it was full of really awesome stuff. Um, not just the movements, but also how the creative process around the movements has evolved, or how it was during the time of Toyota. It was really, really fun to see, to be honest. Well, basically, at least people my age have grown up watching movements, so it's kind of big thing. Um, I, I don't actually know how children nowadays if they watch them, but uh, it's it's kind of spread over the world and uh, it's pretty famous also in Japan.
Yeah, I'm Aki and I'm from Tampere. The games I like to play are mainly high tempo FPS games, so at, at the moment I'm playing these Battlegrounds. I got interested in that, but I've been gaming for maybe 17 or 18 years now. Started from Worms games and moved to Quake and then kind of stuck with the FPS games. The first time I got to Twitch is maybe from some links and nowadays I'm mainly watching Helen streams as she's a long time friend of mine so I want to support her. I'm Snakerfin and I I play games on Twitch mostly. PC uh, and uh, I do have a few consoles that I use randomly. I am a mod for Helen Fave mainly and I am also her editor. I am also moderator for a big one of the moderators for a big music channel, a couple streams and then uh, uh, a smaller streamer who streams randomly, Sugar Girl 90. Some of the people are on the meet are, um, are my real life friends, like two of them actually, and the uh, rest of them I've met through Twitch. And there will be ten of us meeting people I have never seen before. It's very, very scary. Hey, I'm Pelotar. I stream music on Twitch. I started with gaming and nowadays I'm mod for a couple channels. I've been on Twitch like active since last year, so about one year. I play acoustic guitar and try to learn random songs so that people can also ask me something. Twitch in Finland is not so common. I know a couple of streamers and they are actually like Sieni Mili, she's really big and an awesome person. Then there is Limbo that streams guitar playing. But otherwise, well, there is Henna, uh, Helen Faye, she's the one that ordered the meeting here and it's, she's an awesome person as well. <laughs> Don't come to see me. Um, why would people want to see me? That's a good question. I don't really know. If you like some random things and music, maybe. But I just want that everyone has a good time. Like, it was, uh, to me, it was the best room escape I've ever done. Yeah, we escaped, of course, we escaped because it was the best one. I got into Twitch uh, back in the days of Justin TV. I actually don't exactly remember how. I think it was that I found a Pokemon player, a Finnish Pokemon player on YouTube. Then I found the streaming side of Justin TV and uh, eventually Twitch TV. Meeting people from Twitch in real life has been really, really frightening because I'm kind of a loner person. I like myself, my camera, and meeting people face to face and on a terms of that is of everyone, just on my terms, is just both awesome because there's awesome people all around Twitch, just so supportive. Awesome people meeting in real life, but it's also terrifying because I don't have my camera to hide behind. <laughs> From 
Yeah, and then he can't go in and he can't go out. If you go into the igloo, it's like Super Mario. If you go into the igloo, there's a clear starting point of the entry tube and exit point of the entry tube. Because when you have crawled enough, yeah. you are inside. Uh, I like Twitch uh, for the oh, for the community when it's when it's good of course but in uh, bigger streams uh, it can be very toxic but uh, a good community is always good always very enjoyable and also I, I feel I've gained many friends through Twitch yeah, meeting, meeting many people I haven't seen this time, which kind of known in Twitch. Most of the people are, are the same as they are in Twitch. Okay, they will like this. Yeah. Nice, no <laughs> horrible surprises. <laughs> I've been thinking about uh, wanting to meet uh, people on Twitch uh, or those who I know through Twitch uh, for a longer time. But I got one that is really good. And this is the story about fighting love. What? Fighting love. Uh, but mostly uh, it's been my personal problems. Uh, or uh, disabilities that have uh, kept me not not going anywhere and uh, then there's the side that many of them uh, live abroad so when this chance happened to have a meet in Finland then I just decided to take it normally I play flute on Twitch and play some games. Truly, like, it's about 50 50, like, games and music. I started playing flute when I was uh, 10 years old and kind of continued that uh, through elementary school and, and upper secondary school. And then I decided to go study music and. Uh, and uh, then I decided to kind of, after a few years, I decided not to continue studying music because of the career opportunities are really non-existent here. And then I found Twitch, like, then I found music from Twitch and I was like, hmm, maybe I should do this myself.
guitar for about one year and nine months now. I must say I have, I do feel the improvement but I also feel that the last few months I kind of plateaued about it so I do feel a little bit frustrated I'm not really learning more but I'm trying to access that frustration with the help of my chat and people coming in tossing in helpful information and options for me. People should check out my channel because um, I do quite a lot of different styles of music, like game music, old, really old game music and stuff like that. And I have two doggies on the background usually when I when I play music. People shouldn't check out my channel more than coming in and saying hi and have a chilled, relaxed time. I'm streaming because I need an incentive to pick up the guitar and Twitch streaming has given me that incentive. I'm not streaming to gain more viewers, I'm not streaming to build a community, I'm not streaming in order to get a fan base or anything like that. I'm streaming because I'm a Twitch lurker and I need an incentive to learn to pick up the guitar. Alright, I've had three days here in Finland and I'm on the way back to the airport. Just uh, made a quick stop to reflect really on my um, short really fun visit to Finland and uh, meet some of the Finnish people and absorb some of their culture. Um, it's a beautiful country, really is. Um, population of about 5 million, so much, much less densely populated than back home in the UK. And everyone is so nice here. Um, standard of English is incredible, really. I uh, didn't find anyone who wasn't willing to speak to me in English, which is good because uh, my Finnish is not really that great. Um, and the, the culture seems so laid back as well. Um, it is obviously a lot colder here than in the UK. And um, it's a really bleak kind of picturesque landscape. You know, lots of really tall evergreen trees and uh, wide open spaces which I didn't really get to see before because it was dark, but uh, now I get to drive in the daylight. Uh, you can really get a sense of that. And it's really nice to um, just come somewhere totally different. You know, um, Finland's probably not a major tourist destination for most people, but it's, um, it's people really make it, I think. Same with any country, you know, the people really make the country. And it's, yeah, so friendly. Everyone was uh, really good service. And I've really, really enjoyed spending some time here and absorbing some of the culture. And I got to spend a, a long weekend with two very friendly dogs. I'm pretty sure that you can see the result of uh, some long hair dogs, which I'm not, I'm not used to. So a big thanks to everybody who came to the meetup and uh, gave up their weekend to spend some time with some random people from the internet. I, I came from the furthest away, um, but you guys all spoke English the whole time, even though it wasn't your native language and you could have easily spoken Finnish. So I guess you made me feel uh, just as welcome as everyone else. And it is, it is hard to recommend Finland as a tourist destination, you know, because Brits like to go somewhere hot. They like to have uh, all, all the alcohol and the swimming pool and they like to just chill out for a long time. It's not like that for me. I love to go places and meet real people, see real, real cities and uh, absorb some of the culture. So if that's your kind of thing and you don't mind the cold, which I certainly don't, then uh, maybe Finland's next on your list. Yeah.